Hi, I'm Chris. Uh, what we're going to do today is look at the connector class. This is your connector class box. Uh, in here you'll find some hubs and some wires to connect up your class. Uh, your little hub should look something like this. It has a USB port here that can go into your computer uh, and other ports for your connection of your cables. Take this cable here and you can connect this up to your TI Inspire handheld into the USB port at the top. That will connect up. Then we'll take this and we'll connect it into our laptop. Okay, now we've connected up our TI Inspire handheld with our connected class. We're going to uh, look at some of the things that you can do with your connected class. Uh, we're going to look at the transfer tool that allows you to send files uh, before you've started your class. We're going to look at how you begin your class and, and what happens to uh, your pupils' details as you do that. Uh, and then we're also going to look at uh, logging on as a pupil and just seeing how that appears uh, on the on the pupil's handheld. So let's start off uh, by using the transfer tool. Uh, I'm going to click on the tools menu, uh, select the transfer tool option. Uh, all I need to do there is just choose the file that I want to transfer. Uh, it will open my file structure, uh, choose the file that I want, select that, press start transfer, and there we are. It starts to send uh, files to each of the handhelds that are connected. If I connect more handhelds uh, and the transfer is still running, I'll be able to send that file to each of those handhelds as well. Uh, if at any stage I want to stop the transfer, just press stop transfer and it'll ask me, am I sure? Yes. So let's look what happens when you start your class with Connector Class. Click Begin Class. It then gives you the option to send files to uh, students in your class, collect files from their handheld, and also delete the files from their handheld uh, as you collect them. So using one of these tools, if I press Send to Class, it gives me the option to choose what file I want to send. Choose that from my file structure. Uh, I can send it to the whole class, or I can send it just to individuals in the class. Uh, and press Finish, and that will send. It will appear here in the class record. Uh, I just need to make sure that that student has uh, logged in. So we sent a file to one of our students. We need to make sure that student logs in. So we're going to use the handheld to, uh, to ask them to do that. Press Control and Home. That's the Tools menu. Uh, option number seven will allow you to log in. The student first needs to enter in their uh, username. Then they need to press tab, enter in their password, and press enter to log in. And that will give them a message showing them that they've logged in. Uh, in this case, I've uh, transferred files to that student. It told the student that the files had been transferred on the handheld. And we can see that on here on our connected class as well.